guys welcome back to another video as you guys can see i have the new air jordan 1 mid top the man was not meant to fly which comes in this alternate colored box the paper which says limits like fear are often just an illusion and it comes with this a card that says that exact same thing. Limits like fear are often just the illusion. Simon Michael Jordan on the back, it has fear crossed out, which I really like that. It also comes with red laces that you can swap out, which originally I had that on one of the shoes and I realized it's very bright to have that red laces on there. It's mostly a dark shoe, so. And it also had this hang tag which also feels like it's made out of the same new book new book material as the rest of the shoe as fear crossed out then limits like fear are often just an illusion on the other side all that paper is very loud i love this box since it's just it's just inverted colors it's very cool i love it and as you guys can see, it has a jeweled or squishy swoosh on it. I don't know how much you guys can tell, but it's a gel swoosh. And it's a, my favorite part of the shoe, actually. I didn't think I would like it until I got it in hand. Uh, I also really like the laces there, which are all black and they say... Who said man was not meant to fly, which Michael Jordan said during his uh, speech into the Hall of Fame. As you can see, it has red stitching all throughout, it's red on the sole, and it has red right there on the Wings logo, which I really love that. It's, let me see if I can pull this out actually, hold on, no I really can't. But as you guys can see on the insult, it says fear, has it crossed out again. And I was going to try and pull it out, I really couldn't. That's actually something I want to point out. When I went to buy this shoe this morning, the insole was kind of not laying flat into it. It was kind of like hang, it was like not, I could tell it wasn't glued in, which is weird now that I can't pull it out uh, I won't keep trying but once I I was like the insole doesn't fit in there right until I put my foot in and then it kind of just I guess just squished it into place the material it's I would say if you've gone in and you felt the Jordan one low or any other mid top with a new buck it's it's just like that the tongue it's very stiff it's got that jump man on it uh, it has no jump man on the back thank god uh, I really don't like anything on the heel of the Jordan one so it's just have the all black the red stitching that looks nice uh, really this is just such a nice looking shoe I couldn't pass up on it I usually don't like the Jordan 1 mid tops when the yellow toes came out I was upset with that when uh the those green like this green on the mid top and it was the Chicago style I hated that the leather was such terrible quality these aren't usually good quality which is why I really don't like them but I saw this pair I loved it so much it's probably gonna end up turning into a beater within the year with well within 2020 it'll end up as a beater so hopefully they'll start to make Jordan 1 mids really good quality I would honestly pay a bit more if they put better suede and leather on it like that that's the that's the one thing I want on Jordan 1 mids is higher quality material like seriously this leather would be amazing on any Jordan 1 mid. It would make it an immediate cop because they do make a lot of good colorways for the mids. It's just, again, I don't want to buy 
materials that are gonna that are going to be creased up and gross after a couple wears, which I'm afraid for this shoe. I'm actually gonna put this back on because I'm going to be wearing them all today. And thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really quick wanted to talk about this. Please stay tuned. There's going to be much more videos coming soon. So please, please, please like, share, and subscribe, and have a wonderful, wonderful day.